Having the work experience alongside the course is, is really invaluable. The way that Salford University have designed the course is designed to be so similar to the industry. You have to come up with your design initially and design and then you have to have the technical ability to go through it and then ultimately you have to be able to sell and present your idea. It's just like the workplace. Our crits at university are very similar to our sort of design team meetings at practice because you'll lay everything out, you'll talk to the seniors about it and then they'll give their feedback and you go back and redevelop so it's, it's very much the same process. I'm really enjoying my placement at Hodges and Partners. It's really great to be in a professional environment because you start realising things from university, it starts all clicking together as a, the industry as a whole. As a university they've always had a very close relationship with industry. They wanted to make very positive connections between the school and practices. I think live projects are so important in the development of a student's thinking to actually get them to understand you know, that there are some real live issues that when they get into practice that we have to address. It's what's really great is you have the initial visit and you have this idea and you go away and work on it but then being able to go back is when you really start to see the building. Like I was actually pacing my building out on the ground thinking right this is where my entrance would be and then to be able to work in the office which is actually delivering the building Every week I'm sort of seeing the pictures of the updates of the construction and going ahead and just can't wait to get in really to see it. So we've just been to New York for 10 days as part of our summer school and the experience was just absolutely incredible. Went and visited some of the new buildings like the vessel but then we also managed to go into uh, four different architects practices. A very small practice in Brooklyn which has only had a few staff in it to one of the biggest that's doing the tallest skyscraper in the city. From my New York experience, I really got to understand sort of the life of the immigrant. They've had to leave their home behind and start again, and how does someone do that? How does someone create a sense of community? And I found something new that interests me there, so I want to deliver that in my next year project. We live in architecture, we work in architecture, we walk amongst architecture, and it affects the way that people live, and it's hugely important. 